basically a uh, triangular or arc shaped frames used to make rigid structures our bridge is combination of king and queen truss which is commonly known as ixi bridge all the beams are ranked as per their contribution in bridge strength in our bridge there are three main trusses connected by angular and straight line supports king and queen posts are in compression whereas common rafters and princess posts are in tension princess posts and common rafters are in tension which are used to prevent sagging of tie beam of mass lies above the time being whereas in inverted version the center of mass lies below the time being which makes the overall structure more stable the angle of the triangle bond change under the pressure this implies triangle is a very stable shape when load is applied to it the installation of normal bridge is more expensive and difficult than the installation of its counterpart this type of bridges can be easily suspended from tip to tip in a canyon Transitional equilibrium of forces. We know that the sum of all forces in x-axis is equal to zero. Sum of all forces in y-axis is equal to zero. Therefore, we can say that uh, summation f(x) is equal to zero. Summation f(y) is equal to zero. Here, f(x) and f(y) represents force in x-axis and y-axis. Force applied on the bridge of by the mass is equal to 180 kg into 9.8 meter per second is equal to 1764 newtons. In the stress strain curve, strain is placed in the x-axis as it is the independent parameter. 
but stress is dependent on strain therefore placed in the y axis stress is defined as force per unit area the above shown graph was made using actual values from our experiment in the above shown graph we see that from point a to b stress is directly proportional to strain therefore b is the proportional limit of our bridge now at point c the elastic limit of bridge is reached if any further load is applied this will result in permanent plastic deformation d the yielding point of our structure is the maximum reachable strength the bridge is at the verge of collapse at point e which is also called the fracture point a structure collapses under 1.74 kilonewtons force